Good morning, David here, Weekly Weekbook, Friday 26th of February. Usual, we're looking at May uh, 2016 UK wheat chart, uh, pre-market open, video going out at seven o'clock in the morning. And as usual, we'll start with a long-term chart look on a monthly as we're coming towards the end of um, February. And you see here, we've got this red candle that we're forming during February, and we're taking out the last swing low of last year. Obviously, 106.23 we've been watching. 104 last night's close, so we're breaking through that. Um, ultimate target on this chart would be looking here to go down to £95 a tonne. Obviously, a recapture and reclose above the 106.23 would be, you know, vacate that uh, predict, you know, call on the on this monthly chart. On the weekly, um, as we draw close, you can see here we've got this big weekly candle here, red below the swing low here 106.23 obviously uh, close tonight below this would indicate further weakness and now we'll pop down into the daily and you can see here on the daily um, swing low indicated here these three daily candles that we've had here uh, this week uh, which has taken us down Obviously, uh, since we broke the 639 on this daily chart, our, our call would be 101, 51, 55, then 98, and then 95. Uh, but obviously, uh, that looking fairly um, clean break now, this 106. We pop down into the 4 hour. Have a look on the 4 hour. Let's have a look here. And you can see here, uh, last week, um, on the close, we last night we uh, last Friday we uh, closed here 106.20. I was calling for 103.97. Obviously, that got hit pretty much um, straight on mark here. It's broken through and touched a low of 103.40. Um, obviously, this opens the door for 101.55. Um, so, obviously, looking for some kind of um, probably bounce back up here 104 but ultimately for next week we're looking for a test of 101 um, obviously um, a close back above 106.39 would then lead to a bounce back up to 108 uh, but obviously the trend is down we're taking out a major swing low um, I'll just check on the moving averages yeah you can see here all moving averages still pointing down Value is about 109, that's on 30 day, five days, 106, 40 below all moving averages. We did get that spike and bounce off the 106. You can see um, second week in February, that soon failed. Volume has um, dry, dried up, though still negative, and we're closed last night, 104. So obviously, um, you know, um, obviously we're, we're going between these two levels, 106, 39, 101. And obviously we've gone 50%, 103.97 to the T, um, calling this opens the way down to 101. And obviously um, negation of this is obviously if we close above 106.39. And I'll have an update this time next week. Thank